one second, folks. Just when you thought like it couldn't get better, they're like, yo, something even better for you to collaborate with other people and boost your engagement. It's called collab. That's right. So what I'm going to attempt to do is share my phone screen and we're just going to do a live collab uh, right in the beginning here. But uh, we got some folks watching live. So, you know, we like to give shout outs. Where are you watching from? We got Jeffrey Scott Stanton in the building. He's from New York. Actually, I, we got to get a New York, New York uh, sound bite. That's, uh, that's cool. All right. So we got Jeffrey Scott watching. Who else? Who else we got? Where are you guys at? Where are you from? Where are you from? What you doing? Okay. I'm trying to segue here as I, as I pull up my other screen. Just a moment, I'm going to the shared screen. Here we go. Boom! Yo, tell me that does not look funky fresh, though. I mean, shoot. I am getting better every day. Progress, not perfection. So this is, I already, I'm on Zoom. I'm using Zoom to share my screen, and I'm sharing the Zoom on the live feed on Facebook. Your brain's going to explode right off the bat. So let's see what we got here. Oh, we got Shay Keys. What up, Shay from Maryland? We got Billy P from Billings, Montana. We got Renita Brooks from Houston in the house. We got Texas. Um, then we got Lisa from Lincoln. Oh, Lisa, I like the alliteration. Love it, love it, love it. And then, of course, Mr. Worldwide and NYC, uh, Jeffrey Scott Stanton. So let me just do this. I'm going to go to the Zoom. Video Zoom. Where are we at? Okay, there we are. Boom. Okay, behind the scenes, and I'm going to share my screen. Share it. Start now. Oh yeah, there it is, baby. We're yo. Sometimes I I I do things in theory. I'm like, this should work. It should work perfectly. But then I'm like, let's just wait till I see what happens when it. When it goes live, hey, Heather Frank from New Jersey. Um, all right, so what we're going to do is I'm going to go over here to the IG. Okay, you guys see I'm in IG. It's going to be a little bit laggy. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go like here, like I'm going to create a post. Okay. Hi, everybody. This is me. I'm doing a post. But I'm going to go like this. Uh, this is Love Pichu. Pichu. Sorry, Love uh, I messed up your last name, but we're doing a live with her at 11 o'clock central time in another two hours. She's from Dallas, Texas. So Renita, maybe you should connect with her. Um, okay. I'm just going to select this photo real quick, All right? I'm going to go new post and then I'm going to go like this. Now, when I get in here in the tag people section, let's just say I'm going to go, yep, dip, 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 right? Then I'm going to go. No, I didn't turn off my alerts. Don't be texting me while I'm doing this, Jeff. Um, tag people. Okay, here's the new feature. Like adding a tag really didn't boost your engagement that much, right? Because I get tagged and stuff all the time. Matter of fact, some of you tag me in stuff that you shouldn't tag me in. Nobody who's watching this uh, live, I'm sure. But other people, like, don't don't tag people if they're not in the video or a part of the collaboration. That's a uh, That's just like common courtesy but if i go here and i go invite collaborator okay now mm -mm -mm, let's see uh jeffrey scott and i we have a a podcast that we're doing love official love and real estate okay that's her so i invited her as a collaborator very different than adding her uh, tagging her in the post because just tagging her lets her know that it appears in a different section in Instagram that nobody looks at, especially the person you tagged. Uh, when you add them as a collaborator, and I, I would take this one step further, I did this for a post that I did that was a, a, a scheduled live video, okay? Because that's another new feature is you can schedule your live videos on Instagram. All right, so I added her as a collaborator, and then I'm going to go here. Um, I'm just going to post it because who cares? I can delete it later. Um, but you get the idea. So think of all of the possibilities. You can use this. If you're interviewing somebody who's like 
has a huge social media following. Dude, you add them as a collaborator that you're doing a live video with them, it automatically appears in their feed. They don't have to repost it. They don't have to regram it. They don't have to, I mean, that's what we used to do. Like if I get tagged in, in something that I, I'm um, gonna be doing a video or collaboration with somebody, I then have to take their post and use a separate app to repost it. And really the, the algorithm doesn't love that as much. The algorithm is loving this, okay? New collab feature. I'm just gonna collab feature. Okay, you can add your location. I'm just gonna put J-Man Speaks. Um, when you're doing fundraisers, you could do that. You can create a promotion. That's if you boosted it. And then I'm going to, I don't know if, what if it does. If I, if I add it to Facebook, it's going to add it to my Facebook page. I'm going to add it to my Twitter feed. And that's it. I'm going to hit that. Done. So on the other side, if Love was watching live, it's going to appear um, that you were invited to a collaboration. Okay, she has to accept it, and then it, it's going to appear on both of our accounts. All right. Let me stop sharing that right now. There's no tomorrow. Okay, coming back over here. So you could see there, huge game changer. Instagram, if you're not going hard into Instagram, it keeps getting better and better and better and better. Um, uh, Facebook, if you're not up to date on what's going on there, they're changing their name to Meta because they got some bad press uh, and they want to be known as they're creating a whole metaverse, which is a whole um, virtual world, which we can live in. So rather than scroll Facebook, you could put it on VR goggles and the Oculus Rift, you know, the hand things, and you could live in this virtual world. Um, there was a movie about it. What was that? With the robot. Shoot, somebody posted in the comments if you know the movie that I'm talking about where they, uh, all the people were living in a virtual world and they were so fat and overweight they didn't have bones anymore because they were sitting in these hovercraft chairs. Damn it, I'm going to remember it after, uh, after the broadcast. But let me go back over here and give you guys some, some love. Here we go.